Good evening, everybody. We are uh, pretty wild out there this evening, especially when you compare it to what is headed our way by the time we get to uh, not 24 hours from now, but especially into our Friday. So live eye view, clouds have sunk back into the area after a little bit of blue sky and sunshine today. Temperatures, though, still bearable in the mid-60s for some of us, really east of the Navasota River. That is where you start finding temperatures in the upper 50s, low 60s, a little bit thicker cloud cover and fog there this morning and afternoon this evening we will continue to drop temperatures again in the mid to low 60s to start and then really only in the mid to upper 50s for our overnight lows reason why cloud cover and a little bit of humidity returning just in time to give us a chance for some rain and here's a look at it on your pinpoint forecast a pretty fleeting shot at some showers in fact by the time we get to about 9 10 o'clock and possibly a little bit later than that. I think we will start to uh, see things clear out and we'll see some sunshine by the end of the day. So here's a look at what temperatures will do along with that, especially into the afternoon. Likely getting into the upper 60s, low 70s very briefly, and then we drop big time. At 9 o'clock on Thursday, we're back down into the low 40s, upper 30s, and we will drop down into the low 30s, maybe even upper 20s by Friday morning. You factor that in with the wind chill, and things get even colder than that. So another thing to deal with is the gusty conditions. We'll see gusts to about 20 miles per hour all the way through the overnight here tonight. And then by tomorrow morning, especially as that little second blast of Arctic air comes through by the afternoon hours on Thursday, we'll see some gusts to about 25 to 30, possibly even up to 40 miles per hour by Thursday evening. So it will be a windy Thursday and a windy start to Friday before things calm down a little bit. Back to tonight, lows will be in the mid to upper 50s. Just a chance for some showers. I think more likely we will see some drizzle through the overnight and into tomorrow morning. So an umbrella, not a bad idea by the time we get to tomorrow. Temperatures try to get again into the upper 60s, low 70s. And there's a seven-day forecast for you. 53, your high on Friday. That will be the warmest day of the weekend. Saturday, Sunday, also looking for highs in the low 50s. And overnight lows get down into the mid to upper 20s by Sunday. Then it looks like possibility of some scattered showers and just some cold rain falling by the time we get to Tuesday and Wednesday of next week.